In this video, I want to investigate how to find the Cartesian equation of the half line represented by something like the argument of z being pi over 3. Okay, so let's draw it. So real axis, imaginary axis, pi over 3, something like this. So that angle's pi over 3, and we're not including the origin. Okay, now we know that the angle... Uh, we know the angle that it makes with the horizontal being pi over 3. Now, if I just drop a perpendicular down there to the uh, real axis, okay, then think about basic trig, okay, and your basic knowledge of gradients. You know that the gradient of a line is the um, difference in y divided by the difference in x. Now, for your right angle triangle, this is the opposite over the adjacent, OK? Now, the opposite of the adjacent, you understand to be tan, tan of the angle. So the gradient of your line is equal to tan of the angle, because that is the opposite over the adjacent, OK? So that means that I can go to my Cartesian form by saying, right, well, it's going to be y equals tan of pi over 3 times x. OK, so tan of pi over 3 is root 3. So y equals root 3x is the Cartesian form that I am interested in. Now, if you were to change this up to the argument of z take away uh, 2 plus 7i is equal to pi over 3, OK? What's the Cartesian form for that? Well, what you now understand it to be is, I know that the gradient's going to be root 3, so I just need to think, well, it's y take away y1. Now, I know that it start, it's going through um, 2 minus 7, OK? So that would be plus 7 and minus 2 here, so root 3 x minus 2. And so that is the Cartesian equation of the line. And if you want to give it in um, uh, y equals mx plus c form, so it would be y equals root 3 x uh, take away 2 root 3 take away 7. OK? And so that would be the Cartesian form of your uh, half line. Now, obviously, this is not, because it's a half line, that means that uh, the domain is restricted. So for this one, you'd be saying, well, x is greater than 0, right? OK. And for this one, you need x to be greater than 2. OK. But if you just needed to find the Cartesian equation, this is how you can go about it. 